it's a somewhat overcast day for the drivers, who've now taken position on the grid. And here we have the Alfa Romeo. They're in P1. Let's see if they can take advantage of that position. And it's the second Alfa Romeo there. They've managed a third place start for this race, but can they turn it into a win? The race start is mere seconds away. It's the race we've all been waiting for. It's the Austrian Grand Prix. It's lights out and away we go. Good job. Alfa Romeo just moved up a place. Oh, there's a spin! Here's the replay. Now, just watch the Mercedes here. And this, yes, this is where they spun out. What happened there? Now, just watch the Mercedes here. And there it is. That's where they spin out.
be box, isn't it? So you can push a bit more. Looks like there's been a lockup. Let's take a look at the replay. Now just focus on the Hass. Well, oh, they've lost it. They've locked up. The team are really disappointed with that. Let's hope it doesn't set them back too badly. Seems to have been a lockup. Let's have a look. Okay, here's the Ferrari. That lockup could have cost them dearly. And the team had such high hopes today. What a shame. Position gained for Alfa Romeo. We can take a look now. Now let's watch this. The Alfa Romeo involved in this one. And there they go, moving up a position. Just incredible maneuvering. I think it's safe to say that went down well with the team. There's been contact and several cars involved. Here's the replay. Okay, so there we have the Alpine. And there's the collision. It's caused absolute carnage. The team are devastated. They'll be questioning just what happened out there. Was that a lockup on the track? Let's see what happened there. Okay, here's the Ferrari. They've locked up, but that could have been much worse. No! That's going to be a big blow to the team. Will they be able to recover? We'll see. Sounds like someone's locked up. Let's take a closer look. Now, just watch the Mercedes here. And this, yes, there, that's the lockup. And that was a bitter blow for the team. And it may have really hurt their overall chances. Oh, we've had a spin. Now we see the Williams here. And that spin is undoubtedly going to cost them time. Sounds like we've had a spin. Let's take a look at the replay. 
Now look at this. It was the Alpha Tauri driver involved. They spun the car. What a disaster. I think there's been a lockup. Now look at this. It was the Alpha Tauri driver involved. Oh, and there's the lockup. That's the last thing they'll have wanted. The team are really disappointed with that. Let's hope it doesn't set them back too badly. Looks like that was a position gained for Alfa Romeo. Now let's watch this. The Alfa Romeo involved in this one. They clear it. Big move for them and a race position gained. The team watching on and clearly loving that. Looks like there's been a lockup. Let's have a look. Now we see the Williams here. And yes, that's the lockup. No! So no rain. Romeo just moved up a place. Let's see what happened there. Now let's watch this. The Alfa Romeo involved in this one. A bold move indeed. And with that, they've gained a position. That was a big moment. The team are clearly delighted.
we need to get these tyres to last. Had a spin. We can take a look now. Now we see the Williams here. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. The car's just gone. And the team had such high hopes today. What a shame. We need more left and coast. Seems to have been a lockup. Let's take a closer look. Now just focus on the Hass. And there's the lockup. It almost got away from them entirely. The team are devastated. They'll be questioning just what happened out there. Is that a lockup? Here's the replay. Now, just watch the Mercedes here. That lockup could have cost them dearly. That's going to be a big blow to the team. Oh, big lock up there. Let's take a look at the replay. We're just watching the Red Bull. They've locked up, but that could have been much worse. And that was a bitter blow for the team. Let's have a look. Now we see the Williams here. And a new position, just gained by Williams. A position gained for Alfa Romeo. Now let's watch this. The Alfa Romeo involved in this one. Goodness me, there they go. Moving ahead of the other driver. The driver's team there cheering them on. I think someone's run wide. Looks like that was a position gained for Alfa Romeo. Let's see what happened there. Now let's watch this. The Alfa Romeo involved in this one. A bold move indeed. And with that, they've gained a position. Back in the garage, the team absolutely loved it. Look at that! They've run wide! Now, just watch the Mercedes here. They're way off the racing line there. That isn't good. just crashed. We're just watching the Red Bull. And that 
That's a big smash. They'll have felt that. The team are really disappointed with that. Let's hope it doesn't set them back too badly. So if you... Focus. And lift off. Did somebody spin out there? We can take a look now. Now look at this. It was the Alpha Tauri driver involved. What a spin! Was that a lockup on the track? That's it. Here's the replay, and it's a win for the Alfa Romeo. They can be really proud of what they've achieved today. A result like that doesn't just fall into your lap. Was a lion.
Fantastic work from the Alfa Romeo driver. A good outcome for Alfa Romeo today. The team have got to be pleased with this performance. I wouldn't be surprised if the team's performance today won them a lot of new fans. After an intense weekend, the team ends in first place in the constructor standings. As we reach mid-season, the battle will pick up again in the Côte d'Azur. Join us in the south of France at the circuit Paul Ricard.